So the first of these starters orders, six finals is next, and this is the hurdle final. And it's over two and a half miles. Most of the qualifiers have been over a little bit further, I think. Anyway, the top one is Pearl Necklace, Obi Wan, Loud Dan's, Darren Howes, Rare Rabbit, Marty Little, Lizard Point, Carla Regante, Solano Beat, and Business Lady, both Alex Cherry, Little Apple, Carla Regante, Trabago, James Follis, and Disney's Nightmare, Stu Gray. Only nine runners then, and there were loads qualified. We had loads of qualifiers for this, so. Uh, Maybe that's something that needs to be looked at. I'm pretty sure the uh, distance of the final is a little bit shorter than most of the qualifiers. Anyway, away they go. We've got nine good horses in it. And Zolano beat and Little Apple. Two of the first to show, but now Pearl Necklace is being driven up on the outside. And we've seen all season long that Pearl Necklace likes to get a lead. And over the first of the 12 flights, Brer Rabbit, the one who's being taken off his feet at the back. Pearl Necklace in front from Little Apple second and Business Lady third as they take the second. And we'll safely over that one. Hurdling well and pace is pretty hot. Pearl Necklace hasn't got that Eskimo horse to deal with today. And he's got a clear lead and no Derek Hinton horse in it either so that means that he won't get anybody challenging him for the lead. I shouldn't have thought it also. That means somebody else will get a chance to win a race. Oh, Derek Hinton's having a bit of a monopoly of late isn't he? So anyway Pearl Necklace is in front. Little Apple is second, Business Ladies third, Zolano beat fourth, then Trabago and Lizard Point. Disney's Nightmare after that one as they take the fourth. And Disney's Nightmare went right through the top of that one, really rattled the top bar of the hurdle and is now the back marker. A little necklace, little necklace, pearl necklace is in the lead from Little Apple in second and Zolano beats third. Trabago is fourth, then Business Ladies after that one. Bit of a gap then to Lizard Point and another tiny gap to Loud Dan's Brer Rabbit and Disney's Nightmare who are the back three. So skipping over that next one then. And the home straight now that one will be the last next time around. Oh, this one though. And I skip over that then there. Pearl Necklace in front. Little Apple second, Trabago third, Zolano beat four, Business Lady five, Lizard Point is after that one. Then Disney's Nightmare, Brer Rabbit and Loud Dance as they swing left-handed for one more circuit of Aintree. This is my final jump race for the SO6 League. I've got one more race to do. That's the National Hunt Flat Race. So no more chases. And this is my final hurdle. So Pearl Necklace in the lead from Little Apple second. Then Business Lady and Zolano beat after that, Lizard Point and Trabago. And this is Nightmare Brer Rabbit and Loud Duns. Pearl Necklace looks like he's going to lead us into the next one. Carla Agante's Little Apple. Is this Lady and Zolano beat both right up there for Alex Cherry. Formula One follows his Trabago. He's just tucked in behind them. And then Lizard Point as well. The second of the Carla Agante horses, I think, with Disney's Nightmare for Stu Gray. Just detached a little bit. We loud dance for Darren Howells at the back with Brer Rabbit as they take number seven. And they're all over that one, and the lead has changed now. Business Lady has come to take it up. And Pearl Necklace will be interesting to see how that one responds. Top weight, remember. That likes to lead as they skip over the eighth. And Business Lady, Little Apple, Pearl Necklace, then Lizard Point and Zolano beat. Trabago as they take the ninth. They've got just three more to take now. On the struggling at the back is Loud Dan's, but Business Lady's gone for home. Here comes Trabago, throwing down a big challenge. Then Pearl Necklace, Little Apple, Lizard Point, Disney's Nightmare looks to be going well. Zolano Beach just dropping back a little bit. Brown Rabbit is starting to run on. Loud Dan's is the back marker. Business Lady is in the lead over the third last then. Lands in front from Trabago. Pearl Necklace is now switched to the outside and is coming back to re-challenge. Then Disney's Nightmare is in fourth. Zolano beat now runs on into fifth. Then comes Lizard Point. Little Apple after that one. A gap to Loud Dan's and Brown Rabbit who both look beaten. But it's now Business Lady on the inside. Pearl Necklace on the outside between the two Trabago. Wide on the track. Zolano beat. Disney's Nightmare looking for him and can't find any as they come down towards the final two flights then there. And Business Lady, Pearl Necklace and Trabago 
Oh, it's Disney's nightmare. Got a double handful on that one, but now he's got a split as they take the second last. And Pearl Necklace has regained the lead. Suddenly, Business Lady looks under pressure. Here comes Disney's nightmare. Disney's nightmare swoops into the lead from Business Lady in second. Pearl Necklace over the final flight they go. It's Disney's nightmare in front from Business Lady in second. Pearl Necklace is beating loud. Dan's is running off from the back, but Disney's nightmare looks like he might take this. Racing into the final half. Well, it's Disney's nightmare from Business Lady. Loud Dan's a little up and up towards the line. Disney's nightmare is going to win the start of the six hurdle final. Business Lady is second little apple next then Loud Dan's and Trebago. And Pearl Necklace might have ended up last in the end. It's Disney's Nightmare who takes it for Stu Gray. Business Lady for Alex Cherry was second. Little Apple for Carl Aragante was third. Lad Dan's Darren Howes fourth. And Trabago for James Follis was fifth.